95% of African Americans are lactose intolerant. How could he wear this milk mustache? This is a message. Money is spent by the dairy industry. If you're a doctor, you call their toll-free number, 800-Y-MILK. They'll send you $200 worth of free information. You call my toll-free number, 888-NOT-MILK, they'll get the truth. We're getting the message out as one voice to America. Milk does not do the body good. So, got milk? No. Not milk. Not milk. We have a phone number where people can reach you, mm -hmm. and what is that? It's uh, toll-free. It's 888-NOT-MILK. Robert, thank you very much. Thank you. How do you lose so much weight? Uh, what kind of diet are you on? My, uh, the short answer is I went on essentially a plant-based diet. I live on uh, uh, beans, legumes, vegetables, fruit. I drink a protein supplement every morning, I, no dairy. I drink almond milk mixed in with fruit and a protein powder, so I get the protein for the day when I start the day out. And it changed my whole metabolism, and I lost 24 pounds. And I got back to basically what I weighed in high school. But I did it for a different reason. I mean, I wanted to lose a little weight, but I didn't ever dream this would happen. I did it because after I had this stent put in, I realized that even though it happens quite often that after you have bypasses, you lose the veins because they're thinner and weaker than arteries. The truth is that it clogged up, which means that the cholesterol was still calling buildup in my vein that was part of my bypass. And thank God I could take the stents. I don't want it to happen again. So I did all this research and I saw that 82% of the people since 1986 who have gone on a plant-based, no dairy, no meat of any kind, no chicken, turkey. I eat very little fish. Once in a while I'll have a little fish. Not often. If you can do it, 82% of the people who've done that have begun to heal themselves. Their arterial blockage cleans up. The calcium deposit around their heart breaks up. This movement has been led by a doctor named Caldwell Esselstein at the Cleveland Clinic, Dean Ornish, whom you know, out in California, the doctors Campbell, father and son, who wrote the China study, and a handful of others. But we now have 25 years of evidence. And so I thought, well, since I need to lose a little weight for Chelsea's wedding, I'll become part of this experiment. I'll see if I can be one of those that can have a self-clearing mechanism. We'll see. I hope you're healthy for many years and, and, and get to see grandchildren for many years. Me to too. Come. That's really the big deal. You know, I, Hillary and I, uh, we're happy. We love our son-in-law and we admire him, but... 95% of African Americans are lactose intolerant. How could he wear this milk mustache?